Welcome to NewsChannel5.com on a Friday. I'm meteorologist Leland Statham. Around the Mid-South for today, a chilly day, a cold night. Look at this. We've got a freeze warning out for all of Kentucky and for most of Tennessee, the exception a couple of locations in West Tennessee and down in deep southern middle Tennessee. Uh, here in Nashville, an overnight low of 34, but we're close enough to that freezing mark that we'll need uh, this freeze warning. You will have some spots north and northeast that may be between 30 and 32 by sunrise tomorrow. So here is exact track does show that we'll see a few hit miss showers over the mid south for you this afternoon. Now, exact track has been persistent here this morning on holding on to a little bit of a shower chance overnight. So we'll keep an eye on that for some of our northeastern counties. And then as we head toward tomorrow morning cold, so keep that in mind if you've got any morning plans out there. And then tomorrow afternoon, mostly sunny conditions over the area. As we work our way into Saturday night, we're going to be mainly clear, but it will be chilly again. So temperatures near the freezing mark or let's say mid 30s for many areas by day break on Sunday. So here's how real sky plays it out. Notice now look at the winds out of the tent west here 10 to 20 miles per hour. Got plans on this Friday night. By the time we head towards 6 o'clock, we're in the mid 50s there. By the time we head toward the 9 o'clock hour, falling back into the upper 40s. Here now your seven day forecast temperatures rebounding a bit on Sunday, even more so for Monday. Then more rain chances back in here for Monday and Tuesday. Cold front brings us back into the 60s Tuesday, 30s Tuesday night. Our weather artist today, this is a nice one from Heaven uh, Baker. Heaven is a student in Miss Heather Anderson's classroom, Community Elementary in Unionville. We put this rainbow picture up because a lot of you all saw rainbows yesterday. There are plenty of those pictures in the My Five Gallery here on our website. Meanwhile, our school of the day, Lighthouse Christian, a Lighthouse Learning Center in Westmoreland, got a, a note there. Michael Morrison is a student in Mrs. Christian. Christian Gregory's classroom. So everybody at Lighthouse Learning Center in Westmoreland, hello to all of you. Now let's work our way over to Park Avenue on the west side of town. I was there yesterday chatting with the students over at the Park Avenue Enhanced Option School, talking to them about the weather. This is Mrs. Saul Miller's classroom. So Ms. Saul Miller and everybody over there at Park Avenue had a great time with those young boys and girls. They asked lots of good questions. There's also a group video of them on my Facebook page. Check that out at NC5 underscore Leland Statham. As always, we appreciate you much for stopping by newschannel5.com. Make it a great weekend.